the Black Mesa Transit System. This automated train is provided for the security and convenience of the Black Mesa Research Facility personnel. The time is 8.47 a.m. Current topside temperature is 93 degrees with an estimated high of 105. The Black Mesa compound is maintained at a pleasant 68 degrees at all times. Thank you. 
that the Black Mesa Hazard Course Decathlon will commence this evening at 1900 hours in the Level 3 facility. The semifinals for high security personnel will be announced in a separate secure broadcast transmission. Remember, more lives than yours may depend on your fitness. to the Black Mesa team. Immediate openings are available in the areas of materials handling and low clearance security. Please contact Black Mesa personnel for further information. If you have an associate with a background in the areas of theoretical physics, biotechnology, or other high-tech disciplines, please contact our civilian recruiting team the Black Mesa facility is an equal opportunity employer. and biohazard screenings are a requirement of continued employment in the Black Mesa Research Facility. Missing a schedule of your analysis or radiation checkup is grounds for immediate termination. If you feel you have been exposed to radioactive or, or other hazardous materials in the course of your duties, contact your radiation safety officer immediately. Work safe. Work smart. Your future depends on it. Now arriving at Sector C test labs and control facilities. Please stand back from the automated door and wait for the security officer to verify your identity. Before exiting the train, be sure to check your area for personal belongings. Thank you, and have a very safe and productive day. Morning, Mr. Freeman. Looks like you're running late. You know, Barney's been pretty scarce around these parts. Guess his bar tab must have finally caught up with him. Put some pep in that step, Freeman. You're late enough as it is. Hey, Mr. Freeman. I Gordon, had a bunch of messages. I'm in the middle of something here. We had a system crash about, I don't know, 20 minutes ago, and I'm still trying to find my files. Just one of those days, I guess. They were also having some problems down in the test chamber, too, but I think that's all straightened out. They told me to make sure you headed down there as soon as you got into your hazard suit. Good morning, Dr. Freeman. But the thermal protection system seems to be online now. Lambda materials storage area. That experiment is single-handedly responsible for inspiring my career in science. Hold it right there, Mr. Freeman. 
I got explicit orders not to let you through without your hazard suit on. Oh, would you look at that? Freeman actually did Good show morning, up for work Gordon. this morning. Looks like somebody here owes me the lunch. Was just sent down Good morning, test. Freeman. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Got the wrong airlock, Mr. Freeman. You know I can't let you through here. Ah, nothing like the morning of a big test. I can't remember the last time I've seen the lab abuzz with such excitement. Indeed, quite invigorating. Ta-ta! Can you access the mail server? I don't. Morning, champ. Hello. Why do we all have to wear these ridiculous ties? <sighs> Drat. No toilet paper. Did you catch that last punctuation? It's nothing new. Hmm. We should harness the remaining photonic energy to ensure resonance control. What's up, Doc? Do you know how to fix a paper jam? Gordon? Ah, Gordon! 
There you are. Nice of you to finally join us, Doctor. We've just sent the sample down to the test chamber. We've boosted the anti-mass spectrometer to 105%. Bit of a gamble, but we needed the extra resolution. The administrator is very concerned that we get a conclusive analysis of today's sample. I gather he went to some lengths to get it. Mm. They're waiting for you, Gordon. In the test chamber. Right. Come on, then. I'll walk you down. Eli has been busy making last-minute preparations for the new experiment. Greetings, Eli. Morning, Izzy. I trust this morning finds you well. Gordon, good morning. I'm glad you're here. These last-minute changes, they're a bit strange to just... Oh, it's about to go critical. What in the blazes is going on with our equipment? Oh, it was never meant to do this in the first place. Oh. It's nothing we can't handle ourselves, Eli. Go on, Gordon. We'll take it from here. Beckrell's ghost! The radiation level is off the chart. Oh, there you are. Everybody's been looking for you, hombre. Ah, here he is. I'm afraid we'll be deviating a bit from standard analysis procedure today, Gordon. Yes, yes, but with good reason. This is a rare opportunity for us. This is the purest sample we've seen yet. And, potentially, the most unstable. Now, as long as we follow standard insertion procedures, everything will be fine. I don't know how you can say that. Although I will admit that the possibility of a resonance cascade scenario is extremely unlikely. I just don't feel- Gordon doesn't need to hear all this. He's a highly trained professional. We've assured the administrator that nothing will go wrong. Yes. You're right. Gordon, we have complete confidence in you. Well, go ahead. Let's let him in now. Testing. Testing. <clears throat> Everything seems to be in order. All right, Gordon. Your suit should keep you comfortable through all this. The specimen will be delivered to you in a few moments. Now, if you would be so good as to climb up and start the rotors, that way we can bring the anti-mass spectrometer to 80% and hold it there until the carrier arrives. Take it from here. Power to stage one emitters in three, two, one. I'm seeing predictable phase arrays. Stage two emitters activating now. Uh, Gordon, we cannot predict how long the system can operate at this level nor how long the reading will take. But please, work as quickly as you can. Overhead capacitors to 105%. Uh, it's probably not a problem. Probably. But I'm showing a small discrepancy in... Well, no. It's well with an acceptable balance here. Sustaining sequence. We've just been informed that the sample is ready, Gordon. It should be coming up to you at any moment. Look to the delivery system for your specimen. Standard insertion. 
insertion of non-standard specimen. Go ahead, Gordon. Slot the carrier into the analysis port. What is he doing in there? There's nothing you need to worry about. Uh, go ahead, Gordon. reach anyone in the facility. We need to get to the surface and let someone know that we're stranded down here. There's no telling what kind of danger. <laughs> Leave me for the retinal scanner. I'm certain the rest of the science team will help you along the way. And for God's sake, Keep that suit on until you're in the clear. You hear me? Yeah. 
see you. What the hell are these things, man? And why are they wearing science team uniforms? Ready when you are, Doc. Shoot the damn thing! Nobody back home is Child time zone. <laughs> Excuse me. 
Okay, I'm gonna try to call for help. There's got to be somebody. Anybody reading me? Come in, anybody. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, thank God. Listen, I know where you can find some more weaponry. There's a security office not far from here. Take me with you, and I'll unlock the door. Sally forth. Observations detected. <laughs> Gordon, is that you? It's ah! Oh, oh dear. I do believe I soiled myself. Mission completed. <laughs> 